and I'm super excited because today is a fun video. I was asked to be a part of a, it's called the Traveling Surprise Fiber Box, and I'm super excited about it. Um, gosh, I was asked forever ago, you guys. I totally forgot about it until um, I got it in the mail. But basically, I was contacted by Reggie of um, J-Hook Crochet, and she asked me to be a part of this. And it, she said that it was going to be a worldwide, kind of like surprise fiber thing. So the idea is you get the box, you look through it, pick out only the items you want, show them on a video, and then send the box on to the next person on the list. There are like, I think I counted, like 37 people on this list. And it's worldwide. So it comes from different places. It goes to different places. You have to, sorry, I'm shaking the camera again. You have to really uh, pay attention, watch the, for the video, search for them, and you'll be able to see what everybody is getting. I'm so, so excited. So this was started by, I have it all right here so that I can remember you guys because lately my memory is like gone. Anyways, um... Reggie from J Hook, Natalie of Natalie's Closet, and Catherine of Cats or Cath Cats <laughs> Eye Catchers. I'm so sorry if I can't say that right. My speech is slightly impaired these days. But anyways, so they are the ones that designed this wonderful idea, and it is a really large box, you guys. But unfortunately, the box got quite damaged in the mail. But it's okay because I have plenty of boxes, so I'm just gonna transplant this stuff into a new box and move on. There was a lot in there. I only picked three items um, just because everything in the box, I keep looking at the box, you guys. Everything in the box was pretty, and it was really lovely. And I was like, oh, I could use this for this. But really, to be realistic, it, um, I only wanted to take stuff I absolutely wanted to work with. So I just left the rest for the next person. And obviously, I'm going to include a couple of things here when I package it up and send it on to the next person. Okay, so uh, the first thing, well, not the first thing I saw, but it's definitely the first thing I'm going to keep here, is actually some embroidery floss, and it is these neons. There was two packs of it, so I'm take both packs. Oddly, I guess it's I guess it's the same brand, just different labels. But so it's got some neon pink, some kind of like fuchsia -y orange, some green, and some yellow. So I have been actually I know I haven't actually talked about it on the channel, but I'm super getting into some embroidery, cross stitch kind of stuff. So when I opened it and I saw those, I was like, uh, neons, yes please. My hair. If you hear a loud thumping, it's my children. They're running about the house like maniacs. But anyways, <laughs> so that was the number one thing I took. The next thing actually isn't even for me. My son, my older son, Bruce, saw this, and he fell in love. And I was like, all right, sure. It's this. So it looks like an old treasure map. It's so cute, right? But then you um, unwrap it. Let me see if I'm holding it upside down. I was. And it's a crochet hook holder, and it comes with some crochet hooks. And I already have a very extensive collection of crochet hooks, and I actually don't like to use these skinny ones, but he does, and he needs crochet hooks. So I decided I would get this little map. It's so cute. It just rolls back up on itself, and you just kind of wrap it, and you tuck the coin under the wrapped self and you have like this little treasure map. I thought it was so, so cute. And I know he is going to love and adore it. So keeping this one for my son. And then the only other thing I simply could not pass up. It's actually a sport weight skein of yarn. And I don't even really have, I think I have three skeins of sport weight yarn, you guys. Well, no, because I got some recently. So I have quite a few that I didn't realize I had but this one I wasn't going to take it because it was sport weight and I'm like I have mostly fingering weight yarn but when I felt it I had to so I'm going to tell you about it before I show you or no I'll show you it's by Southern Skeins and this is it this beautiful green and it looks like it was their July 2020 colorway so Southern Skeins 
and it is their not sock yarn club so okay they have a yarn club that's what it is and this is color alpaca my yarn on 100 percent baby alpaca uh it's 100 grams for 220 yards it is a sport weight you guys i don't know raise your hand if you've ever felt baby alpaca yarn it is amazing it is so so can you see the halo look at the halo yeah the halo is ridiculous but that's part of the charm and it is the softest thing i've ever felt in my life it is so soft it's like right up there with cashmere just so soft so when i felt it i was like i have to have this i think i'm going to make myself a cowl because i just want this touching me <laughs> like all the time you guys so 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 soft. So soft. So that is what I got out of the Traveling Surprise Yarn Box. And you guys should go check out some other videos. There's a couple of people who have already gotten the box. I think I'm like the third or fourth person that's gotten the box. And I am going to package it up and get it sent off to uh, another person who I love to watch her videos. So I'm sure you guys will love to watch her videos. Actually, there was, there's actually like seven or eight people I was like, I want to send it to that person. I want to send it to that person. I want to send it to everybody. So I just narrowed it down. I picked one. I was like, boop. And I'm going to send it to that one. So I'm not going to tell you who. Because I'm going to make you guys look for it. This one piece of hair. Drive me nuts. Anyway. So that is what I got out of the traveling surprise box. I'll show you one more time. The embroidery floss. The crochet hook map holder thingy. And this beautiful, beautiful skinny yarn. Oh, it's so pretty. It's so, so soft. All right, guys. Be sure to go check out um, everybody else's videos. Uh, check out, uh, you know, obviously you should subscribe to J-Hooks. You guys know I love J-Hooks. She's such a sweetheart. And um, Natalie from Natalie's Closet. She's sweet, too. I like her. And Catherine from Kath, Kath's Eye Catchers. I have not heard of that one. But I'm going to go check her out myself. So you guys should check her out too. And look for more of the Traveling Surprise Yarn Box. Okay guys? Bye!